welcome to another video and today we are going to be playing one of the classic arcade games from the uh, from the 1980s that game is outrun by Sega so I'll be loading that up from uh, cassette uh, the cassette version for the Commodore 64 was published by US Gold and my recollection is, is that the, the arcade game was just awesome. You know, that'll be one of the games I'll be uh, making a point of playing on if I went to an arcade. And when it was announced that Outrun would be coming out for the Commodore 64, it was like a natural thing to just go and buy this game. With high hopes that it would be just like the arcade, but of course, in reality, it, was, it didn't turn out to be that way. Um, still... It was uh, an enjoyable game to play, and um, I don't think I ever got, I ever completed it. I think I might have got to maybe the third stage or maybe the fourth stage, but it'll be interesting to see how far I can get today in, in, in today's playthrough. <laughs> Now, the cassette version actually did include two cassettes in the package. One included the, the game, and the second cassette included the music from the arcade version, so you could actually play that on, a, on your regular tape recorder, your Walkman or whatever it was, and you could actually listen to the uh, arcade in-game music on your, on your stereo. While the game is loading, I just want to remind you all to uh, please go ahead and take a moment to subscribe to the channel and give a thumbs up for the video, as that will enable other Commodore 64 enthusiasts like yourself, it will enable them to find my videos a little bit easier due to the way how the YouTube search algorithm works. I believe the game did initially come out in the arcade in 86. Uh, I think the the ports to 8-bit didn't occur until 87. I might be wrong on that, but... Uh, while the game's loading, I'll take a, lo I'll take a look at the, uh, the cassette box and see if there's any indication of 1987 on there. Interestingly, inside the uh, the cassette packaging, it does mention upcoming games, and those would include Road Blasters, Rolling Thunder, and Impossible Mission 2. Now, I've never played Impossible Mission 2. I had a hard enough time playing the original Impossible Mission, as you might have seen in one of my earlier videos.
so let's change the, uh, the radio station. Let's start the first game. We'll play the first one with uh, the Splash Wave, which is the most common game music for our There we go. By the way, this looks like this game is working in Joystick Port 1. stage. before I started the game. I still didn't even get to the second stage. 
I did a little bit better than the first time round. Let's try one more time. Folks, that was Outrun by Sega. That was the 8-bit conversion to the Commodore 64, released, I believe, in 1987. As you can see, I'm a little bit rusty on that game. Didn't get to the second stage. But, uh... It was a lot of good fun, and it was the closest thing we can get to playing Outrun versus going down to the local arcade machine and waiting to get on one of those machines. But anyway... Uh, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope to see you on the next video. Don't forget to uh, share, like, and subscribe. We appreciate it. We appreciate it very much. Thanks again, and see you soon.